You probably already suspect that delivering an oral presentation via Zoom is very different from delivering it in person. It may seem easier until you do it. Understanding the Zoom platform is the first step in being able to present a good speech in this computer-mediated medium. In this video, we will focus on just a few simple tricks to get your Zoom screen in a usable format. In other words, teaching you to help yourself. One way to help yourself is to get Zoom off of your full screen. This will help you find your way back to Zoom if you click out of it. To do this, click on the black part of your Zoom screen and click Escape. You'll see the screen blink black, and then everything else looks the same except that you will see your computer's taskbar, the horizontal bar at the bottom of your screen where you see your programs icons. If you ever need to go to another program when on Zoom, now, of course we know you'd never slip out of a Zoom meeting to check your email, but if you do, click on the appropriate icon in your computer taskbar, and that application will pop up in front of your Zoom window. When you want to get back to Zoom, click on the Zoom icon at the bottom, and you're right back to where you belong, in Zoom. Now let's move, literally. The first thing I recommend you do is hide your self-view. In 2021, Stanford News noted that one reason we get so tired in Zoom meetings is that we see ourselves all the time. Luckily, this is an easy fix. Just move your cursor up to the right-hand corner of your webcam image. You'll see three horizontal dots in a tiny blue box. Click that and you'll find the Hide Self view in the menu. Choose that and you'll disappear. If you want to see yourself again, just go up to the upper right corner of your Zoom window where you will see the viewing options and look, show self view as an option and you're back. This next moving tip works for Zoom audiences too. When somebody shares a screen, Zoom's default is to stack your audience's webcam images vertically on the right side of your screen. Wouldn't it be nice to be able to move it out of the way? You can do this by placing your cursor on the top black bar of the webcam image, where you see four icons. Grab this top bar and move it out of the way. Here's a pro tip. Click what I call the Brady Bunch icon on the right, the one with the nine squares and a 3x3 formation. That puts your images in gallery view. Then move those webcam images right under your webcam. You can resize it so that it fits just across the top of your screen. That way, instead of looking down and to the right to see your audience, you can look right at the top of the screen, right under your webcam. It will drastically improve your eye contact if you have difficulty just talking to your webcam. The last tip I'll give you is another moving one. The same technique you use to move the webcam images around can be used to move your Zoom toolbar around. Just click on a black spot and drag it. There's so much more you can do to up your Zoom presentation skills, but these simple tips, getting out a full screen view, hiding your self view, relocating your webcam images to a better location, and moving your Zoom toolbar around should help you present like a pro. And of course, all of this will take practice to do it smoothly, but you and your audience will appreciate your presentation so much more.